on Volpro Overclock here, and basically, we this is the the this is the second package that I got today, and it's basically just a, a USB desk fan. This should be easy to set up. I should hope so. Nah. Now I won't have Matt bugging me. Ooh! It has blue, it has blue blades. This is, since, um, since I have the in no, stop pointing at that, stop. Just since I have face. the inability to sweat, or like, even if I try to sweat, my skin absorbs the sweat faster than it can actually stay out. This is actually great for me to cool down. So let me... Untwist this. Give me a second, and boom. I'm just gonna put that there. Great Earth guy. This is gonna be right here for now. Let me um, if I get, I'm gonna just put this over here. So this is oh. It has leather on on it. Okay, let me let me plug this in. I'm gonna almost there's like USB slots on underneath here, uh, so I can uh, get so that I can you know plug in like that. So this is the first speed. Uh, not bad, not bad. Second speed. Huh? Oh wait, wait. Okay, I see, I see, I see. So first speed. First speed I can get down with. Second speed it is not bad. And third speed is very good. Okay, even though it starting it starts making sounds, but then again, um, what, what miniature fan will make sounds at the high speed? This actually is really good. As you see, it's 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 a nice casing, and the cage itself is connected to the stand, so you won't have to worry about any of this uh, being broken except for the fan blades messing up and, and it doesn't look like you can actually get into the fan blades unless you actually break this cage off so if this were to ever stop working I'd have to just buy a new one so basically uh, from, from the speeds already the first speed is very good for me hey right. stop pointing at that point at me the first speed is really good. I mostly had the the uh the fan used to be here, um for some and this is actually very good and like this is good enough to cool me down. So I'm just gonna be using this for now. And what's good is that I just have to click one button, not not different buttons for different things. If I want this to be higher, I had to click this button. If I want it to be lower, I had to click it a few times. Do you want me to show the there button? Yeah, sure. It's right here. It has a blue LED, plus there's a button. You just have to click on that. Basically, the only downside to this so far that I see is that when you turn it on, when you start changing the fan settings, like 1 to 2 to 3, it's actually a bit of a response lag. Like, it takes a bit for the settings to actually speed up. But, but besides with, the, you know, with the taking uh, a few seconds to change to the next uh, level, this actually is really good. It's definitely worth around like the eight dollars I pay for it. This would be down to kitchen below if you want a USB fan. It's very good, very refreshing. But anyways, I shall see. I shall see at least. I shall see everyone watching this in another Vopro overclock video or like whenever I do another video. And peace out.